Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you in ASP.NET how to send multiple emails using C Sharp. And here we got the final output of that code. Now I'm adding the two address, charan at gmail.com, comma, I'm adding the second email ID, which is charan at gmail.com. The subject is, hello, test email. Now before sending this email to these email IDs, let's open my Gmail account. Here I already opened my Gmail accounts. One is at charan3k and second one is at charanpay at gmail.com. Let's send an email. Send. See here we got a message. Mails has been sent successfully. See here we got the mail. Charan hello test mail. Test email. See here we got the test email charantrika at gmail.com If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. For this video tutorial, I am creating a new ASP.NET project. Go to file, new, project. I am choosing ASP.NET web application and the, and the .NET framework is 4.6.1. The application name is emails multiple click OK and from the templates I'm choosing empty click OK and here the project is successfully created open solution explorer I'm adding a new web form page in this project right click the project name add new item and the web form I'm changing the web form page to email add and here we got the source page of the email.aspx page now between this body and do tag I'm center tag I'm adding header h1 how to send multiple emails ASP.NET C Sharp horizontal line after the horizontal line I am adding a table the table border is equals to 1 TR TD the two address td I'm adding a text box control between this td tag open toolbox text box control I'm changing the text box id to text to new tr td and this one I'm giving the label subject td and I'm adding the text box control between this td again go to toolbox text box control text subject let's copy this and the last control I'm adding for the text box body text body and the text mode is multi line after adding the text box controls now I'm adding one button control and one label control to display the message so after the table I'm adding a button control toolbox button control and the button label name I'm changing to send 
break the last control I'm adding the literal control I'm changing the literal ID to literal message that's it we have done the designing part switch to the design mode double click the button click and here we got the button click event in order to send an email first we need to add the namespaces using system.net using system.net.mail after adding these two namespaces now I can able to access the mail classes mail message mm is equals to new mail message mm dot from is equals to new mail address and this mail address method takes a address as a string so here I'm adding the challenge 3k at gmail.com I want to send email from this email ID mm.subject is equals to text subject dot text mm dot body is equals to text body dot text now here I'm writing the logic to send multiple email addresses for that I'm using string array to address is equals to text box to dot text dot split method between single quotes I'm adding comma for each loop string and in to address mm.2.add dot two dot add method mail address string variable n now I am adding the SMTP client SMTP client SMTP is equals to new SMTP client SMTP dot host the host for gmail is SMTP dot gmail dot com the next one we require the port number SMTP dot port for the gmail the port number is a 587 now I am adding the network credential and c is equals to new network credential which takes five parameters the username and the password I am adding here in this network credential method here the username and the password is your gmail ids Sharon 3k gmail.com comma and the password is I'm adding password only just for the security reasons I'm not providing my real password but at the time of sending this email I will change into the real credential SMTP dot enable SSL is equals to true SMTP dot credentials this credential state I'm adding the network credential object which is NC and the last I'm adding SMTP dot send method We're sending the email with the mail message object MM after sending the email successfully I want to display the message for that I have added the literal control literal message dot text is equals to mail has been sent successfully that's it we have done the complete coding part now it's time to check the results in the browser Google Chrome and here we got the final output of that code now I'm adding the two address channel3k at gmail.com comma 
I'm adding the second email ID, which is k at gmail.com. The subject is hello test email. Now before sending this email to these email IDs, let's open my Gmail account. Here I already opened my Gmail accounts. One is at charan 3 k and second one is at charanpay at gmail.com. Let's send an email. Send. See here we got a message, mails has been sent successfully. See here we got the mail, Charan hello test mail, test email. See here we got the test email, charan3k at gmail.com, that's it.